Molly, the terror attack taking place just before 10 p.m. local time in central Paris. A man armed with a knife began stabbing people at random, killing one, wounding four others, two seriously. The suspect was shot dead by police. This video shows people running for their lives and a person lying on the ground, either wounded or dead. Witnesses described the chaos of the attack, which took place near the city's opera house. I was having a drink with a friend, and I heard a boom boom. I thought it was gunshots. I went out and saw a bloke lying on the ground. After that, we rushed back into the bar. Now, witnesses say the man shouted, Allahu Akbar, or God is great, as he stabbed people. The Islamic State's news agency has claimed the suspect was one of its soldiers. But again, the Islamic State has done this before. They have falsely claimed, claimed responsibility, so we shall see. The Paris prosecutor has opened a terrorism investigation into the knife attack. France's counterterrorism authorities are investigating. France's president, Emmanuel Macron, tweeted a short time ago, quote, all my thoughts go to the victims and the wounded of the knife attack perpetrated tonight in Paris, as well as to their relatives. I salute on behalf of all the French, the courage of the policemen who have neutralized the terrorist. France once again paid the price of blood, but did not give an inch to the enemies of freedom. Again, Molly, two dead, including the knife-wielding man, four injured in a terrorist attack in Paris tonight. Anna, Brian, I mean, France has had a string of these types of attacks uh, since 2015, right? If they have, Molly, less than two months ago, armed police officers killed a 26-year-old man who shot three people dead in a series of attacks in southern France that left 16 people injured. The man said he was fighting on behalf of ISIS. There's been a series of attacks since the 2015 Bataclan concert hall attack, which, remember, left 130 people dead and more than 350 wounded in the deadliest attack of that kind in the nation's history. Molly. All right, Brian Yenis, thanks for gathering all you can on what's happening there in Paris right now.